I think the UK is terribly well placed because for two reasons, the UK government, I think, has actually been very preemptive of the kind of infrastructure that's going to be required, and that's been evident in the cell and gene therapy catapult being initiated and having some quite serious players being involved in that. And also, we have a single payer system, so we can manage and track patients throughout their journey. Um, so when we deliver a therapy that we need to see if still working in five, ten years' time, they won't be lost in the system. We know them, we'll be able to monitor them. And I think from a UK perspective, that's very exciting, albeit from a venture point of view, we are still some way behind the United States.